So I just got done with Sleep Camp, Sleepaway Camp 2. What the fuck was that? Really? I mean, it's like, they were just like, hey, let's make another movie. We're going to throw a bunch of campers that are obviously all at like 25. The one dude had like hella hair down down his chest and it was all, Arr. he's like, hey, you, know, you should check the stock market. You know, not, he didn't really say that, but he might as well have. Like, oh, my parents had to get rid of The youngest kids in there were probably junior high-ish. And everybody else was supposed to be, I guess, high school. And I put the quotes in there. High school. When obviously they were like 30 years old in this camp. And then you have the campers. that uh, The counselors look the exact same age as the counselors. Wait, did I say that right? No. The counselors look the exact same age as the campers. This movie's got my head twisted all up as in this is dumb. Wow, dude. Like, and I think what really takes away from this is in a lot of these, in all these movies, there's a killer. And then you you have your ideas of who the killer is, but they don't really show the killer until the big reveal. And right away, you know who the killer is. And it just doesn't, I mean, you pick up right away who she is. And what's going on? There's no mystery to this. It's just a bunch of dumb, random killings. The best killing in this whole movie was when the guy got his head chopped off. <sighs> Excuse me. Um, yeah, I mean, there's so much wrong with this movie. Like, there's, like, better killings than things killing. I'm just saying. <laughs>